How to get an API key for Google Maps. Google Maps API lets you embed maps, geolocation, routing, and places info into your website or app. In this video, we'll guide you through getting and setting up your API key. Let's get started. First, open the Google Cloud Console and log in with your Google account. Next, in the Cloud Console, click the Project Selector in the top left corner. From the Project Selector, choose New Project. This gives you a clean workspace for setting up Google Maps. Enter a name for your project and click Create. Once the project is created, we'll need to enable the Maps APIs that you'll be using. Go to APIs and Services on the left menu. Then click Library to explore available APIs for your project. In the Library search bar, type Maps JavaScript API, then select it from the results. This is the core service for showing maps on your site. Click on Enable. This activates the service so your project can start using it. Repeat the process for other APIs like geocoding, places, or directions. Now that your project is set up, let's create the API key. Next, open the Credentials section under APIs and Services. Here you'll manage and create your API keys. Select the project you just created. Double check this step because the API key will only work correctly if linked to the right project. Then, click Create Credentials and select API key. Google will instantly generate a new key for your project. A new API key will be generated. Now, we need to set security restrictions on the API key to prevent unauthorized use. In the Credentials section, click on the newly created API key. This opens its settings, where you can apply restrictions. Set appropriate restrictions based on your needs. For web projects, select HTTP refers, and for server requests, choose IP addresses. In the API restrictions section, check only the APIs you plan to use. Now, your API key is ready to be used. You can now integrate it into your project's code. Troubleshoot common errors. Sometimes you might encounter some common errors. Don't worry, here's how to fix them. Invalid key map error. It usually means the API key is incorrect. Double check that you've copied it correctly from the console. Billing not enabled error. That means you need to enable billing for your Google Cloud project. Make sure that's set up. Set up billing and quotas. Google Maps offers a free quota for each account, but beyond that, it will charge. Go to the Google Cloud Billing section, where you can add a payment method, manage billing settings, and keep your services running smoothly. Set up budget and alerts to monitor your usage and receive notifications. And that's it. Your API key is ready. If this helped, like and subscribe.